Between my time at Saturday Night Live, the late night show, and my brief run here on The Tonight Show, I've worked with NBC for over 20 years. Yes, we have our differences right now. Yes, we're going our separate ways. But this company has been my home for most of my adult life. I am enormously proud of the work we've done together, and I want to thank NBC for making it all possible. I really do. Making this choice has been enormously difficult. This is the best job in the world. I absolutely love doing it. And I have the, uh, the best staff and crew in the history of the medium. I will fight anybody who says I don't, uh, but no one would. Um, but despite this sense of loss, I really feel this should be a happy moment. Every comedian, every comedian dreams of hosting The Tonight Show. And for seven months, I got to do it. And I did it my way with people I love, I do not regret one second. I have had more good fortune than anybody I know. And if our next gig is doing a show in a 7-Eleven parking lot, we will find a way to make it fun. We really will. I have, I have no problems. And I don't want to do it in a 7-Eleven parking lot. Uh, finally, I have something to say uh, to our fans. This massive outpouring of support and passion from so many people has been overwhelming for me. You made a sad situation joyous and inspirational. So to all the people watching, I can never, ever thank you enough for the kindness to me. I'll think about it for the rest of my life. And all I ask is one thing, and this is, I'm asking this particularly of young people that watch. Please do not be cynical. I hate cynicism. For the record, it's my least favorite quality. It doesn't lead anywhere. Nobody in life gets exactly what they thought they were going to get. But if you work really hard and you're kind, amazing things will happen. I'm telling you, amazing things will happen. I'm telling you. It's just